much about the city of Detroit, how it's on a roll. New businesses, new fountains, better looking this, lofts, apartments, new restaurants, but beneath it all and underneath that layer of excitement remains a struggle for so many. And there's an organization that's working to provide basic needs to these folks, but it, uh, it needs your help to continue making a difference in so many lives. I'm Willie Campbell. I'm the executive director of Core City Neighborhoods. Core City Neighborhoods is a community development corporation that tries to improve the quality of life for everybody in the area with the hopes of stimulating progress in the surrounding areas of the city also. And we do this by providing uh, affordable housing. They started out by refurbishing old houses and apartment buildings. Core City evolved to doing new houses where we did uh, all total, we've probably done maybe 350 housing units in the area. Tuesday and Wednesday, we provide uh, boxes of grocery. We give out uh, fresh and frozen foods to people who need it. Anyone in the city can come here to Core City Neighborhoods and get a box of food if they want to. We do this in partnership with Forgotten Harvest and a few other local uh, stores who bring in produce. And once we identify a need, we find a way to resolve it. Man, do we need folks like that doing such great work. We want to welcome Reverend V. Lonnie Peake Jr., who's back, brought us this story on behalf of our partners at Wayne County Community College District. This organization has been described as a hidden figure in our community. Why is that? Yeah, yeah, Chuck, they're, they're over there right off of Jeffries as you get to the bridge. You probably pass it a thousand times, and when you come up and look over there, their houses, their development, mm -hmm. and it's core city neighborhoods. And that was Willie Campbell we just saw. He does an excellent job. And they have this big old convent. It used to be a convent. Mm -hmm. And community folks come in there two, three times a, a week for food, for clothes, or for shelter. They're doing an excellent job. Oh, and the houses you saw, they, had, they have, let me see, 300 mm, 350 houses they have redeveloped, and they lease them and rent them back to people in, in the neighborhood. But you know, this discussion is happening from Mayor Duggan uh, right through the neighborhoods about gentrifying of neighborhoods. So here, yes. here is a group that's helping carry out this mission. Is it, has it been hard for them to do this? Very hard. Now, the yeah. Archdiocese has supported them tremendously, oh, so good. we want to give them a play. So I, I think when, when the mayor gave the piece up in Mackinac, this focuses in on people who are doing things in the community. Sure. They don't get all the glitter, they don't get all the awards, yeah. but they're, without them to stabilize in the community, it doesn't matter what downtown or midtown does. So what can all of us do to help them? Well, that's a good question to ask me. We I bet do, you you've got it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Call 313-580-2386, 580-2386. They're looking for volunteers. Tuesday and Wednesday, food and clothing, and they need people to help to distribute it. Very cool. All right, so there's another group making ah. a difference, and they are all under the age of 40. 40. Those young whippersnappers. Yeah, yeah, they don't know nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the Ball Foundation is hosting the second annual Excellence Under 40 event this Saturday, June 10th. And our own uh, Andrew Humphrey will be the MC. Channel 4 is a corporate sponsor, and this is honoring folks who are, who are working with young folks. And young folks carry on our legacy, so if we don't work with them, mm -hmm. they have no legacy to carry on. And you can get tickets at the Ball Foundation M-1.org. Ball Foundation M-1. Oh, M I. Randy said it's M I, so it must be M I. <laughs> so tell everybody again. Oh, it's right there on the screen. Is it on the screen? Yeah. Ball pay, Foundation, pay attention to the screen. I. Yeah, don't, don't, pay attention, don't pay attention to well, what I Randy, said. It's Randy's deal, right? Oh, yeah. That's, that's, my, that's okay. my thing. That's, that's his Randy. charitable organization. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And R Randy does good, good work. Oh, oh. Zoom it out. So. Uh, <laughs> zoom out a lot. It's Randy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It, it, it'll be this Saturday. Uh, uh, Andrew Humphrey serving as master of ceremony, but yes. we got four young people doing outstanding things in the community. Awesome. So come down to MGM Grand and uh, support us and go to ballfoundationmi.org. And you know, Reverend, you my guy. Don't worry <laughs> about you, you the man. You the man, oh, Randy. Yeah. You the man. You the man. Hey, listen, if you want to make, uh, you know, make some help in the neighborhood, you want to do something, we've got all kinds of special organizations making a difference in our community. We want to know about more of them. Let us know by emailing Reverend V. Lonnie Peak Jr. at vlonniepeak at gmail.com. Do Good it. See you. Thanks, Chuck. We'll be right back. All right. All right.